I actually rather like this level. Please, in terms of, I don't know, I think it's actually going to be a bitch in a time trial, but in terms of aesthetic design, it's actually kind of cool. And there's bits where I'll actually go forward in the level rather than like left or right. Okay, I completely lost depth perception there. Okay, buggered it there. No, I knew as soon as I went for the jump that I'd screwed it. I don't mind this level type though. Really? Can I not do that? Something went wrong there. What just happened? I guess I must have like fallen off the side somewhere, but I actually couldn't see myself. Okay, that area with the one boxes seems sketchy as hell. Okay, careful when on those platforms. Okay. They last a bit longer than I think they do. Oh, bollocks. Okay. Need to pay more attention there. Damn it. I, I saw them coming, but just hit square that bit too late. Bollocks. I thought I spun the box, not bounced it, but... And into the darkness. If for whatever reason I lose my mask before the appropriate point, I'll actually, like, do the hidden stairs if I can remember where it is, and try and see if the time boxes are there. None of those were time boxes. Actually, I'm just going to continue with this attempt. Just in case... There's a third box anywhere, and I won't know because that spider just uh, dumb fucked me. Okay, never mind. Bit quick on the trigger there. Alright, the snake is sniping the one box on that point. Almost fucked it.
10509. That felt like a good time. And it's a two box level, so I could have used masks to break through on that fire pit. As such, it's not going to be anywhere near the best time. Oh, if I check the leaderboard. Holy shit, that's a generous platinum. Again, I'm still quite a way behind the uh, top time, but I'm definitely a lot closer to top time than I am plat. Oh, good lord. Next up is this pile of shit. Hey, pre previous levels, I will say, all the previous levels except Native Fortress, I have had fun doing the time trials on, despite the deaths. This may fall into a different story. I guess we'll find out soon enough. Okay. I think I may have to resort to using the ropes, simply because it is going to be faster on some parts of the level. Hey, when I was doing it normally, like, uh, well, throw to know in the high road. So far, it's not necessary to use the ropes. Although it's... But it is necessary that I pay attention. The thing is, the bridge levels are actually my least favourite for... Not, not just gameplay reasons, I actually think they, like, look the worst as well. Mainly, especially after, like, one of my viewers pointed out, that thing in the... That sort of, like, orange castle in the background that doesn't actually seem to, like, change distance. And I can't unsee it now. So I actually think they're like the, especially for like the HD remake of this game, I, I, I definitely say they're like the worst levels to play. They're the worst levels visually. Actually, I'd say the high road is, is definitely the worst because road to nowhere, I, I like the bonus area. I after you get the red gem, I like how that area looks. Whoops, I spun the TNT. Yep, spinning TNT is deadly. Even on the bridge levels. I actually think the pl like going on the planks will be faster in sub areas, especially where you got like the blue planks where you slip down for the extra speed that's gained from doing so. Like here. Huh? That requires further investigation. I'm going to have to watch that one back. Oh, spun the TNT again. Ugh, can I get my shit together, please? Sure. How many times have I spun the TNT now? Try and use the ropes early in the level, because it probably will save a bit of time on some of those areas. And I'll actually get practice at uh, mounting and dismounting the ropes. Okay, can I just jump over the head? I got to do like some secret ancient lost technique. 
Okay, it just randomly slipped off because reasons. Okay, that might be the better way to do things. Okay, awesome. Not awesome. Okay, with the, the difference in varying slopes, it's a case of uh, ropes again for that part. How many depths is this and how much time? For fuck's sake. What's the noise? I'm going to attempt the bounce of the TNT every time because I know it's the faster method. I've actually got to start putting my faith in just straight, straight walking. But not when that happens. Oh, did I forget to activate the time trial? Oh, come on. My shadow was right there. Why did I do that? Shaky, but I'll take it. Get on the fucking rope. Fuck! Fuckity fuck, fuck a fuck, fuck. Yeah, maybe I should put PG 13 warning. Mild offensive language. Shit, 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 shit. I don't know why I do that. I mean, like, say I, like, don't jump at one point. I end up, like, mashing the X button as if it's gonna help. It's almost like I'm trying to wake the fucking thing up. What? 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 The fuck just happened. Do you ever find yourself in a situation and think, how the fuck did I get here? Center? It is good. Okay, I think that's a bit to the right. Yeah, tweaked it. Gild the rope. Oh my god, yes, finally. In fact, fuck it's a platinum. I don't know how long I was in that level. 
I would rather not know. Good lord, that was... Ugh. Yuck. Now, this should be interesting. Leaderboard. So... A little under three seconds behind top time, but five and a half ahead of Platt. And Stealth just barely got Platt. And if he was taking it cautiously through the level, then smart choice. You did the right thing. I, like an idiot, just kept dying. Time to save, I think. Uh, that's not the right button. Sorry, my mind has just turned to mush after that level. Anyways, I'm going to have a break knowing that the next level, i.e. Boulder Dash, I'm actually going to enjoy. Yeah, I'm going to go. Okay, let's get into a level which I'll actually enjoy. Yeah, God, Road to Nowhere was painful. Yeah, Boulder Dash. I like the Boulder levels, and it's fairly... Okay, I was... I don't think any of those boxes were, uh... were, uh, useful at the beginning. That part, I was literally just mashing at X for those jumps. Oh, I thought I uh, fucked it there. Ah, that look, that's looking a bit close. Again, the boulder much more threatening. Than... Oh, just go. I forgot that the TNTs can uh, actually block the time boxes and still have them count. I can't remember what game, but I'm pretty sure there was a game where it didn't work like that. Hoss might have been Warped, might have been Wrath of Cortex, I'm not sure. But at least I know that I can actually use that as a trick. One nineteen forty two gold. Okay, not bad because that was actually my first run. <laughs> Bollocks. Wasn't too sure about that star. 20.2 of that free box, so I'll actually try and remember that as a split time. Box. 
Ninja. I'm already enjoying this much more than uh, <laughs> than uh, Road to Nowhere. And that's a platinum. So yeah, level's fun and there's not too much uh, margin for error. If I was to hazard to guess at top time, it'd be like 1 minute 15. Or what? Uh, well, close enough. <laughs> he beat me by 1 millisecond. <laughs> I'm tempted to go back in just because, but I'll maybe do that off camera at some point. <laughs> 